We just wanted to do a quick video about a handy sort of walk around bag for the beautiful 70 to 200. I've got a Low Pro Pro Tactic 450 AW, which is over there, which I always use when I'm carrying loads of gear to come and do something like this. But when I'm walking around town, perhaps, or just out taking some photos and perhaps just with a couple of bodies, I quite like a sort of a, a sling bag or a shoulder bag where you can just put your bodies in and out. I, I tend not to use a, a camera strap. I mean, this is your body with your camera strap on, but I, I tend to use uh, Peak Design straps and often just don't have them on the camera and just like to pull the bodies out, take a few photos and put them back. And it's, a, it's a hefty lens, isn't it? It's a, it's a it big is. lens. It is. So I thought, well, I'm never going to find a shoulder bag where I can, or a sling bag where I can put it in with another body mm. and walk around with it. You know, it's always going to have to go in the back. And it's a good bag. It's probably about 50 quid. It's, so it's look, padded inside. It's padded yeah. inside, yeah. You can move the stuff around. But what i found is if you put this down that bit there, and okay, that's looking, hmm, is it really fitting? But what this sling bag has got, it's a really clever sort of expans expansion bit there. So once you open that, uh, then it's really nicely nestled in there. Okay. And then you can have like another body in there with a 24 to 70 on it or a prime or something. Yeah. And then you can actually just easily walk around with this all day long. This is nestled in the corner. You can pull it out, take a few photos, can't stand camera straps, Russell. You've got to get out of it. You've got to get, you've got to buy into the Peak Design. Peak Design ones are good because you can then clip them. Yeah, straight away. and then you just put it straight back in there. Get another body out. You've got other bits of pockets for various things. I don't know whatever, whatever bags are there that you could use. That well, for. I mean, there's obviously the backpacks, but um, the trouble is with a backpack, you've got to get it off your back yeah. and put it down to get it out. There's no good sling. No, go and go. I, well, not that I've seen so far. So, um, so it's just, I thought it was worth just a very quick video just showing how good this sling bag is for even carrying uh, a 70 it, to 200. Do you feel it knocks into your, it's too heavy on your shoulder? No, not at all, no. I mean, this is quite padded. This is, it's not, you know, it doesn't feel heavy at all with it for on me, there. For me, I would feel a bit insecure because it's not a structured bag in that it's flopping around a bit. Well, I don't think it does flop around. I mean, you know what I mean, like, it's not, if anyone, if you drop it or, you know, someone bangs into you, it's going to take, it is padded a bit, but I don't feel it's... Yeah, I know, but if, I mean, if you're, it's close to your body, though, so you've got yeah. to be careful when it, you're... It, it, well, it, it's, it's not noticeable, is it? Noticeable, is it? You know, you've got, it look, it's quite... I mean, you wouldn't think you've got a 70 to 200 in the no. little sling bag, would you? No. With potentially another body it's in It's really there. discreet. 